Man, I'm excited to hang out with my friends today. I can't wait to invite them to my birthday party this weekend. Never really had a lot of friends before, so I'm glad I met these guys. Oh, I can't believe we're hanging out with Oliver again. I know, right? I can't stand him. He sucks. Oh, but hey, he's got a cool house, and he's super smart. That could come in handy. Yeah, we just need to keep pretending like we're friends, and we'll get our way eventually. Hey, okay, dude, dude shut up. Here he comes. Hey, what's up, guys? Good to see you. Oliver, buddy. So good to see you too, man. Yeah, sup, bro? Oh, not much. I was wondering, do you guys want to come to my birthday party this weekend? It's not a big crowd, but I'd be really happy if you guys came. Uh, yeah, sure, man. We'll go only on one condition. I really need help with my math test. Could you give me the answers? Come on, man. Uh, I don't know. Isn't that basically cheating? Yeah, man, but I thought you were our friend. Huh, guess not. Oh, yeah, that sucks. I, I just don't want to get in trouble, that's all. Okay, fine. Just show us your grade, then. All right, here. I got an A+. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Hey, what the heck? Just be cool, man. Yeah, we better get to class, Kyle. Come on. Later, dude. Don't worry. We promise we won't cheat. Uh, okay, fine. You guys better not. Oliver Stein, please come to the principal's office immediately. Oh, no. What was that about? You wanted to see me, sir? Oliver, I'm really disappointed in you. We've learned that you are cheating on your math test. What? That's impossible. I didn't cheat. So, you think I'm just stupid, do you, huh? Huh? No. We found out that you let your friends copy your test. You're way smarter than those idiots. You didn't think we would find out? They just took my test, but they promised me they wouldn't cheat. Ethan and Kyle wouldn't do that to me. So, are you going to tell on your friends then? If it's really their fault, I'll call them down right now and oh boy, we can settle this. No, no, I'm not. I don't want to get them in trouble. It was me. I let them cheat. Then you're suspended for three days. Get out of my office. You're ridiculous. Oliver better have not ratted us out. He won't. He's too scared. He's such a nerd. Can you believe we have to hang out with him? Oh, I really don't want to. But his birthday party might be worth it, though. This house might have some cool stuff that we can swipe. Oh, yeah. I like that idea, big guy. <laughs> hey, what are you guys talking about? Well, nothing, man. Just hoping you were okay, dude. Yeah, getting called to the principal's office? That's rough. Yeah, it was. There was a really terrible things you guys did to me. I told you not to cheat. Dude, we promised we didn't. The teacher just found the test, that's all. <laughs> oh, Cha, what did you tell the principal? Nothing. I took the blame and now I'm suspended for three days. <laughs> okay, sweet. That's why you're such a good friend, man. Thanks. Yeah, man. My mom would have killed me if I got suspended. Yeah, thanks. I, I guess. I just want to be a good friend to everyone. And... You guys have been pretty good to me, so... Come on, totally. Look, we gotta head out. See you later, Oliver. Hey, hold up. Can I get a ride with you guys? Ugh, fine, whatever. Let's go. Yo, dude, check this out. Oh, 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 this car is sick, dude. Ethan, you're in my neighborhood. You're gonna get us in trouble driving like this. Oh, come on, dude, chill. It's gonna be... Oh, uh oh. Step out of the car. Now! in so much trouble. Just shut up, okay? I'll handle this. We didn't do anything wrong, dude. Leave us alone. Oliver, you doing this in your own neighborhood? Uh, my friends were driving me home and he was just excited to show me his new car. I didn't mean for this to happen. You need to be better than this. Driving like an idiot. Slow down, will ya? Yes, oh, sir. sir. Oliver, you can walk home. It's just over there. But I'm calling your mother and telling her all about this. And you know she ain't gonna be happy. Ugh. Great. Thanks, officer. Good for nothing kids driving like lunatics! Oh, that was a close one. <laughs> yeah, dude. Let's go get some pizza. Yeah, I'm starving. Later, dude. Okay, later, guys. This is not gonna be good. Hey, Oliver. Oh, hey, Brendan. Heard what happened at school today, man. That sucks. Yeah, well, I guess everyone at school knows now, huh? What's going on, man? We need you on the mathlete team this week. Now the coach won't let you do it, so what gives? Look, I'm sorry, man. Things got messed up with Ethan and Kyle, that's all. You shouldn't be hanging out with those guys, dude. 
Why not? I know they're like the most popular kids in school, but they're bad news, man. I know they can be a little rough around the edges, but they're good guys. We should all hang out together sometime. I bet you'd like them. Nah, dude, I'm all set. It's just they've been mean to everyone. And now all of a sudden they want to hang out with you? Doesn't make sense to me. What is that supposed to mean? Well, you know how popular people can be. I know I don't have a lot of friends, but it shouldn't be surprising that someone wants to hang out with me. That's not what I'm saying, man. Ugh, look, we've known each other for a long time and you're one of my best friends. I just don't want you to get mixed up in the wrong crowd. Oliver Stein, get in the house right now! Yeah, I'm in serious trouble. Look, I gotta go. I really hope Kyle and Ethan show up. They're already like 30 minutes late. Where could they be? Ha, <laughs> can you believe this nerd has such a nice house? Yeah, who would have thought? There's gotta be some cool stuff in here. Remember the plan. Of course I remember the plan. I helped come up with it, idiot. Hey, you guys made it. <laughs> of course, bro. What a miss it for the world. So like, how cool is this party? Oh, thanks, man. I mean, it's pretty fun. You want some pizza or cake or something? We got food over there. Oh, dude, those burritos we had earlier are killing me. I gotta hit the bathroom. Uh, yeah, sure, go ahead. Is he gonna be okay? Oh, yeah, he'll be fine. Happy birthday, dude. Whoa, you didn't have to do that. <laughs> it's the least I could do, man. Come on. Oh, perfect. Some jewelry, some cash, and oh, hello. Some car keys. Let's go. <laughs> this is too easy. Dude, I'm sorry, but I gotta go. My stomach's killing me. Uh, all right. Later then. Feel better, dude. We'll see you at school, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. Well, I guess at least they showed up, even if it was for just a minute. Whatever. Time to get back to the party. Hey, your birthday party was a blast, man. Sorry those loser friends of yours bailed on you, though. Uh, it's okay. I was a bit bummed, but it gave me more time to study, I guess, so it's not all that bad. Good. You're gonna need to nail that science internship, dude. Everyone's saying you're gonna be super rich someday. <laughs> yeah, I think I might be. You know, that would be pretty nice. Oliver, can I speak to you for a second? Oh, of course, Mrs. Smith. What's up? Your last paper was incredible. Really outstanding work. Wow, thank you. I stayed up pretty late writing it. I'm recommending you for that internship. There's a good chance you could balance it with college and get a job at the same time. But Oliver, I must say, you need to pick better friends. What the heck? Not you, Brendan. Oh, okay, good. Oliver, it's about your choice of friends, Kyle and Ethan. Let's just say they're not good kids. They're just misunderstood, Mrs. Smith, that's all. I've known those boys for a long time. They might be up to something, playing some kind of prank or who knows what. Just be careful, okay? Uh, okay. Thanks, Mrs. Smith. I'll keep that in mind. See? Even Mrs. Smith doesn't like them. Dude, I hate those guys. Oh, come on, Brendan. Give it up. All right, fine. You got a lot of work to do, dude. Don't let anyone drag you down, especially not those jerks. Yeah, I don't plan on it. And I can figure this out myself. That party was just so sad. Like, imagine having no friends like Oliver. Like, oh. No, I couldn't, huh? <laughs> I'm glad we left before anyone could notice, though. You know, I got laughed at for giving him a ride home the other day. Even Tony made fun of me, and Tony wears braces. That was embarrassing. Oh, yeah, Pat. I got some heat for hanging out with him, too. We just need to stick with him a bit longer. Ugh, how much longer do we need to pretend to be friends with that loser? Just until the final exams. We need him for the answers. Plus, if we could swipe enough stuff from him, we might have enough money to rent an apartment. Get out of our parents' places. Yeah, that sounds like it's going to take forever, though. And I don't have the time to wait. Well, wait then. We might as well have some fun in the meantime. Watch this. I've got an interview for that internship I'm applying for. Man, this is gonna be a huge deal for me. I can't believe this is actually happening. I gotta tell the guys. Wait, what the heck's going on here? Ha <laughs> check it out. Oliver has no friends. Look, there he is. Hey, loser. <laughs> what a loser. Who did this? <laughs> what the heck? This isn't funny. You know what? I don't care what any of you guys think. I'm gonna get out of this school and be successful. You'll all see. Oliver, we need to talk. 
What's wrong, Mom? I think your new friends might be thieves, darling. Wait, really? Why would you say that? My jewelry is missing. So what makes you think it was them? Maybe you just misplaced them. Trust me, I didn't. Thankfully, it wasn't my expensive pieces, but they're still missing. I haven't seen them since your birthday, and my car keys are nowhere to be found. It just sounds like you misplaced some stuff. Like, why would they steal from us? They're my friends. They wouldn't do that. Well, they aren't good people. Mom, that's not like you, judging people like that. You don't even really know them. I want you to have friends, but not friends like them. I don't want them back at this house ever again. Do you understand? Just calm down, okay? I'm gonna find out what happened. Maybe it was just a misunderstanding or something. Uh, Mom? What was that? That sounded like my car! Oh no! My car! It's gone! Oliver, stop! Get back here! I'm gonna find out whoever just stole my mom's car. If this is them, I'm gonna lose it! Oh no! It's been crashed! I hope they're okay. Ethan? Kyle? Are you in there? <coughs> oh, thank goodness. I don't think anyone's in there. What, what's that noise? Ah! Hey, kid. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I I'm fine. Oh, you're lucky you made it out of that car alive. It exploded. I wasn't in the car. Someone stole it. I was with my mom when this happened. Stealing from your mom's car, Oliver? Really? No, no, this is a misunderstanding. I didn't steal anything. So what, should he go to the hospital or like what? Nah, he seems okay. But keep an eye on him. <laughs> Trust me, I plan on it. I'm taking you home, Oliver. You're gonna explain this all to your mom. I'm sure she's gonna love this. Oh, dude, I got your text. What happened? Well, I stole Mrs. Stein's car. I was getting too fast. I lost control. It was insane. Yeah, too bad you're a trash driver. Hey, at least I kind of know how to drive, unlike you. <laughs> it's funny, though. Only Oliver would be dumb enough to let us jack his mom's car and not even suspect a thing. I bet Mrs. Stein has to buy a new car. And there will be more opportunities for us out there, my friend. Trust me. Oh, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> well, we'll just play it smarter next time. No, take me home, dude. I'm over this dumb hospital. They don't even have prime energy drinks in there. Ugh, trash! Where the heck are they? Check it out. Oh, uh, what's up, man? Don't what's up, man, me. Why did you rob my mom? What are you talking about, dude? Yeah, bro, calm down. We didn't rob anyone. Well, my mom's jewelry is missing, and someone stole my mom's car last night. Do you think I'm stupid? <laughs> calm down, Oliver. You're going crazy. It wasn't us, we swear. Maybe someone's jealous you're hanging out with us. You know, the popular guys. Jealous of me? Come on, no one's jealous of me. Oh, I don't know, man. You are pretty cool. That's why we're friends after all, right? I think I know who it might be. Meet me after class. We'll sort this out together. Trust me. Fine, after class. But this better be good. What are we doing here? This is Brendan's locker. Yeah, it is. And check this out. Look what I found. That's my mom's jewelry. I, I just don't get it. What is there to get, dude? Brendan's been my friend forever. He wouldn't do this. There's no way. Yeah, but he did. Look, your mom's jewelry is in here in his locker. What other proof do you need? Hey, what are you guys doing at my locker? I don't know, dude. What are you doing with my mom's jewelry? What? What are you talking about, Oliver? Ethan just found this in your locker. Can't believe you would actually do this. We've been friends since we were kids. My mom invites you out for dinner all the time, and this is how you treat us? I'm really disappointed in you, Brendan, and I'm telling my mom about this. Dude, you gotta believe me. I didn't do this. I don't care what you have to say. I know you had something to do with this, Ethan. Shaw, shut up, nerd. Literally, no one cares about you. All right, Oliver, this is it. Man, I'm so excited, and I'm pretty nervous. Oh, I just hope this interview goes well. I really want this internship. Sorry to keep you waiting, Oliver. I'm Franklin. Please, come on inside. Uh, of course. Oliver, I'll cut to the chase. You've been doing an exceptional job here. I'm impressed by your work and your dedication. Well, I really have a passion for science and technology. I really work as hard as I can. So I've made my decision. I want to offer you the internship. 
Really? Thank you so much, Mr. Franklin. That means a lot to me. And there's more. Your intelligence and work ethic have convinced me that you'll do really well here. We're going to accelerate your school workload so that you can graduate early. Plus, you'll be paid a lot of money for your work here and receive free college tuition. What? Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. My head's going to explode. This is incredible. I can't thank you enough for this. I got to get started. Make a real difference here. I have no doubt you'll do great things, Oliver. Welcome aboard. Kyle! Ethan! Guys! Oh my gosh, I've got great news! What's up, genius? I just got an amazing internship! An internship? Is that supposed to be, like, cool? Oh. Yeah, it is! I'll be finishing high school early, so I can start working as a scientist even sooner! I'll be done with school before everyone else, and I get a free ride to college! Are you serious, dude? Yeah, I thought you'd be happy for me. You're just gonna leave us like that? Leave us here with these idiots? Oh, that's not cool, man. Friends don't do that to each other. Oh. Guys, this is a big deal for me. Well, we're not happy, Oliver. You're ditching us. We're losing our best friend. Yeah, leaving us in the dust to go hang out with cool college kids. Oh. I'm not ditching anyone. I thought you'd understand. This is important for my future. Yeah, your future, not ours. Just go, Oliver, if that's what you want. We don't want you here anymore anyways. Fine, whatever. Thanks, guys. Oh, great. Now what? Without him, we can't cheat our way through school. We're going to fail and not be able to do anything. We can't keep stealing from him if he's not around. Right. We need to figure out a way to stop him from taking that internship. If it's the last thing we do. All right, now time to see the results. Whoa, I think this experiment actually worked. Oh my gosh, this is sick. Oliver, how's it going in here? Pretty good, actually. I just got the result I was looking for with this experiment. Take a look. Excellent. I have to say, you're pulling off experiments that some of our 10-year veterans would struggle with. You should really be proud of yourself. Thank you, Franklin. I think I am. I mean, this is literally a dream come true for me. Just keep up the hard work. With your talent, I have no doubt you're headed for a bright future in science. Oh, thanks. I won't let you down. And I'm ready for whatever comes next. So, got more experiments for me? Hell, this place looks so lame, dude. Yeah, that's because it is, Kyle. Now shut up. This is where we have to stop Oliver. Oh, are you sure about this, man? This feels a little bit extreme. Well, we're extremely cool, aren't we? Oh, obviously. Then shut up and come on. Stop being such a big baby. Hi, I'm not a baby. Oh my gosh, whatever, dude. You're just being dramatic. Come on, let's start breaking stuff. Hey, will you quiet down? Jeez. I think this is enough. Now I need to make him think it was Oliver. And this will do the trick perfectly. <laughs> Funny. Uh, what was that? The alarm. Let's get out of here before we get caught. I can't wait to get back in the lab today. This is so cool that I get to do this. Oh my gosh. What, what happened here? Franklin, what's going on? Why don't you tell me, Oliver? What? After all we've done for you, is this how you repay us? Oh my gosh, no, this wasn't me, I swear. I would never do this. It says Oliver was here right on the wall. Do you think I'm an idiot? No, sir. There's got to be some kind of explanation because this wasn't me. If you didn't want this internship, you should have just said so. Not destroy months of research and vandalize our property. But sir, I... Just get out! You're fired! Oh no. I can't believe this is happening. <laughs> Can you imagine Oliver's face when he saw the lab? Yeah, what a loser. Kind of sad I didn't even get to see it. <laughs> He's going to be in so much trouble. <laughs> I knew it. Kyle and Ethan are behind this. I just need them to admit it. I seriously can't stand Oliver. I hate him so much, and I hate his stupid face. And it sucks having to pretend to be his friend. What would the other popular kids even think? Who cares? We're the most popular kids in school. Oh, uh, true, bro. We just need to find a way to keep using that loser. Oh, no. 
Wait, did you hear that? What was that noise? Someone spying on us? I need to get this back to Oliver and fast. Look, it's that loser, Brendan. Hey, get back here. You can't run from us, nerd. I can't believe I got fired. Who would do something like this? It's gotta be Brendan. He was upset I caught him stealing. He was so mad. He's gotta be the only one, right? Oh, I don't know. Oliver, honey. What's wrong, mom? Have you heard about your friend, Brendan? What? No. What happened? His mother called. He was being chased by some bullies and fell down a hill. He's in the hospital with a broken arm. Really? Well, I guess that's kind of awful. You know, he could use a friend right now. Maybe you should talk to him. But mom, he stole from us. And he's the reason your car blew up. I'm starting to think it wasn't all him. Well, Ethan and Kyle proved to me that it was him. Even if it was, he was always there for you before all of this. He was always your friend, even when you didn't have any. Maybe you should at least hear him out. <sighs> all right, fine. I'll talk to him. Maybe there is more to this story after all. Hey, man. You doing okay? What are you doing here? I thought you hated me. My mom made me come. Wow, that's so nice of you. What happened to you, dude? Those losers, Kyle and Ethan, chased me. They were gonna beat me up, but instead I tripped and fell and did this. Well, were you trying to steal from them or something? No, of course not. I was getting this. Look at my phone. Dude, you need a new phone. Yeah, well, I cracked it when I fell. Just watch the last video. Are you serious? I told you, man. They've been messing with you this whole time. I feel like an idiot. So everything that happened, it was them. <sighs> wow, I'm really sorry, man. I don't know what to say. I don't really know what to do. I've got to go figure this out. I hope you feel better. Yeah, thanks. I know they're always hanging out here. Now where the heck are they? <laughs> <laughs> there they are. Hi, what's up, Oliver? Yo, what's going on, bro? I know it was you guys pretending to be my friends. You think I wouldn't find out eventually? Uh, what are you talking about, man? I saw Brendan, and I saw the video he took of you guys making fun of me behind my back. Oh! Oh, come on, man. Don't be such a little crybaby. We didn't mean to. Shut up! I know you both just think I'm some kind of loser and nerd, and you're gonna try and take advantage of me. Well, guess what? I'm going places. I should have listened to everyone that said not to hang out with you. You guys are the worst! Well, at least other people think we're cool. Cool doesn't matter. Being a good person matters. And you guys are terrible. Good luck with the rest of your lives. We're not friends anymore. This is over. I can't believe that nerd just talked to us like that. Yeah, he's going to regret it. I'm so embarrassed about hanging out with those jerks for so long. I can't believe I was so stupid. I really thought they were my friends. I hate to say I told you so, but... Yeah, I know. You weren't the only one. The people you hang out with shape who you become. And you, Oliver, have a bright future ahead of you. I know. I just wish I could get my internship back. Well, luckily, I was able to explain the situation to Franklin. He's agreed to talk to you again. You start back next Monday. That's great! Maybe I can explain to him what really happened. That would be the wise thing to do. And maybe next time, stop worrying about being popular. It wasn't even really about that, Mrs. Smith. I never cared about being popular. I just never had many friends before. And having no friends feels really lonely and isolating. Who cares if you don't have a lot of friends? You had one very good friend who always stood by you. And you didn't stand by him. Remember that. No. You're right. I'm gonna make things right with Brendan. It's the right thing to do. I still can't believe that jerk Oliver. Yeah, actually, I totally can. What? What are you even saying about right now, Kyle? Look, all I'm saying is he's smart. He was gonna figure it out soon enough. Ugh, I hate smart people. And I hate that stupid Oliver even more. Why though? Cause he thinks he's better than me, and he's not. I'm the best. No one's better than us now. Well, I don't know. We did mess with him pretty bad. I mean, I would be mad too. Dude, shut up. Stop taking his side. 
You need to chill out, bro. You're losing it. What are we doing in school, man? This is Oliver's locker. We're gonna break in, steal his stuff, and fill it with snakes and spiders. I don't have any snakes or spiders, bro. Well then, go and find some, you big idiot. Stop right there, Chris Passums. Oh, get out of my way. Oh, what the heck, bro? You're touching me? Oh, well, you need to find better friends, y'all. But that's enough of that, and that's another time for another storms, okay? You coming with me now. You is in big troubles. Hey, man. What are you doing here? Your mom let me in. How are you feeling? I'm fine. My arm healed up now so I can play video games again, so I guess that's cool. Awesome. Maybe we can hop on and play together tonight. Yeah, I don't know. What do you mean? Do you really want to play games with someone that's not your friend? Yeah, about that. I wanted to say I was sorry. All that stuff I said. I got you something. Whoa, dude, seriously? You got me a new phone? Yeah, I remember yours got broken, and it's the least I could do after everything I didn't. Well, thanks, man. And I want to apologize for what happened. I should have believed you from the start. I just got so wrapped up in what Kyle and Ethan were telling me. I thought they were my real friends. I realized, though, I don't need a million friends. Just my best friend. You really mean that? Of course, man. Good. It's good to have you back. And I'm totally going to kick your butt playing games tonight. Oh, yeah? You're on. Whoa! Oh, look, he's finally out of jail. Shut up, bro. Oh, how was it in there, little crybaby? I said, shut up, dude. It sucked. And it was kind of scary, too. Scared of jail? <laughs> it's not scary. My dad's been in jail plenty of times. Maybe I should have called your mom so you could have cried to her some more. Boo hoo! Oh, dude, I want to smack you so hard right now. Oh my gosh, what's the matter with you, Kyle? What's the matter with me? You totally bailed on me back there! Of course I bailed. Why would I get caught? Oh, whatever. You know, I never thought I'd say this, but I think I miss Oliver. Ew, stop being ridiculous. Oliver's a stupid nerd. Oliver actually cared about us, dude. He cared if we got in trouble or hurt. But you, you, you just care about yourself. Well, it sounds like you're turning into a nerd too. Maybe you should go be friends with Oliver instead of me. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should. Fine, whatever. See if I care, big stupid idiot. I just wanted to say, Thanks for giving me another chance, Franklin. Uh, no problem, Oliver. I I'm sorry we blamed you for the vandalism. It's okay. I mean, it literally said Oliver was here. What else were you gonna think? And I mean it, by the way. I'm really happy to be back. This means the world to me. Oh, good. We're actually glad to have you back. You know, I, I went through something similar when I was younger. You did? Yo, yeah. Kids can be so mean. I knew a kid that would take my science notebooks and fart in them. Oh my gosh, that's disgusting. Yeah, well, it's all about learning and moving forward. Oh, right. Speaking of moving forward, I think I found something really cool that could speed up our technology. Oh yeah? Uh, let me take a look. What do you think? Oh my gosh, Oliver, you just made one of the biggest discoveries this lab has ever seen. What? Really? Yes, absolutely. This is groundbreaking. How did you even figure this out? Well, I had a lot of time on my hands, and I was just focused on something I loved. I worked really hard at it. Well, it's going to pay off. Literally, you know this could make you a millionaire. Man, I can't believe how much my life has changed in three months. This is just amazing. I just spoke at a technology conference. Me. Oh my gosh, this was so sick. Hey, bro. Ethan? Yeah, it's me. Oh, <laughs> I think it's best you leave or I'll call the cops. What? You won't do that. You're too scared. Want to bet? Just calm down, okay? I just wanted to come by, see my old buddy, say what's up. We're not buddies. Oh, yeah? Well, I heard you're a big shot rich guy now, huh? Got so much money, you didn't even know what to do with it. I want you to leave me alone. We're not friends anymore. You're the one that pretended to be my friend, sabotaged me, got me in trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And guess what? Now Kyle isn't even my friend anymore because of you. He's my bro, and he picked you over me. Oh yeah, well good for Kyle. He's better off without you. You know what, rich boy? You're gonna give me your money right now. No, get away from me. I ain't asking you. I'm taking it. 
Hey, hey, is there a problem here? Ah, oh, no! Stay away from me! I don't want to go to jail! Ah! Oh. Sir, are, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Who was that lunatic? He was an old friend. Well, used to be your friend. I hope I don't ever see that guy ever again in my life. I think it's best if you have security on you from now on. We don't need any more weirdos trying to rob you. Yeah, that might be for the best. Keep an eye out for him though, okay? I think he's up to something. This is so cool. I get to give a speech at my old school and tell everyone about all the cool stuff I've been doing. Oh, hey, Oliver. Oh, hey, Kyle. Uh, can we talk for a sec? Why? So you can just make fun of me too? No, I need to apologize, dude, for everything. I messed up big time. Yeah, I'd say so. And I want to make up for it. What is this? This is all the jewelry I took from your mom a while back. Ethan made me keep it. Probably so he wouldn't get in trouble. I'm so sorry, man. Kyle, wow. I'm surprised. Thank you for doing this, man. Yeah, well, whatever, you know? Good luck out there, dude. You're gonna kill it. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Speaking of, I gotta go give this speech. Thank you, everyone. Thank you all for being here. Today, I wanna share with you how much of a complete idiot you are! <laughs> what the? Ah! <laughs> Ethan, are you kidding me? I know was you. Yeah, sucks to suck, nerd. Now everyone knows how stupid you are. Oh, oh no! You better hold it right there, you little creepy mams. Shut up, you toothless idiot. Okay, that's rude, y'all, and you gonna pay for that. You know what? Ugh, what do you want, old man? Your behavior and this stunt you just pulled are completely unacceptable. You're expelled. No!